Hi everyone, today we're going to make a whole fish again. I'm calling it hot pot fish or fish hot pot. You let me know, leave a comment below. What would you call it? Because uh, it will be hot pot flavored, but I'm going to serve in a hot pot, literally. So I can call hot pot fish or fish hot pot. Let me show you the ingredients. Again, today I'm going to use a black sea bass. You can use tilapia red snapper, any other fish you like. And uh, I have seasoned the fish and uh, put in the refrigerator about 15, 20 minutes. Basically, you make few cuts, both sides. And I added uh, Saoxin cooking wine and salt. And check out my other fish recipe, uh, the whole fish and garlic sauce. You will see how to season the fish and cut the fish. And of course, as I mentioned before, all oh, those three trails are Cong Jiang Suan. So green onions, ginger slices, and garlic. The cilantro will be for garlic. And very importantly, the spicy bean paste, broad bean paste with chili oil, this one, dou ban jiang. As I said before, this is a soul of Sichuan kitchens. I cannot cook without this <laughs> and of course the all the spices if you already watched my hot pot recipe and this is pretty much the same spices we have chili peppers handful but you can add more if you need a spicier or less if you need it milder and citron peppercorn this is a black peppercorn and this is a fennel seeds star and anise and cinnamon stick just very small piece of it because it will be very powerful we don't want it to be overpowering and bay leaves this is rock sugar you can have regular sugar about one teaspoon of course to go with my fish i have uh, potato slices soaking in the water so this way it's not going to be oxidized and uh, this is a uh, soft tofu and soybean sprouts and uh, first we're going to make the base to make the fish base first we're going to saute all the spices we add some oil And now we add uh, two tablespoons broad bean paste, dou ban jian. This is the one with the chili oil. We'll turn down a little bit to medium. Let's saute this till the oil is red. Okay, you can see the oil is red and it uh, smells so good. Now we add uh, ginger slices, garlic, cloves. And our spices. Start with chili peppers, citron peppercorns, black peppercorns. This is a fennel seeds, star anise, cinnamon stick, and a rock sugar. Just leave the bay leaves for later. Hmm, smells so good. So after about a minute, now we add chicken stock. Or you can use uh, pork stock. If you don't have any stock, you can use water. It's about uh, four to five cups. 
enough to cover our fish. Should be good. Might as well. <laughs> the whole carton of chicken stock. This is the one without MSG added. And we add our green onions, not like knot them together. And bay leaf. The broad bean paste is pretty salty, so we will adjust later if we need any salt. So we bring this to a boil. Now our base is boiling. We're going to turn down to low, let it simmer. Of course, the longer you simmer it, the tastier it will be. And I'm going to cover it. I pre-boil our pot of water, so we're going to boil the fish for a few minutes just to get rid of the fishy taste. Let's go fish. <laughs> the cooking wine and we're going to cook about two to three minutes okay after two minutes we are ready to transfer the fish I'm just going to skip skim the top okay and turn the heat off and here's a base, still simmering, just move this closer, I need a two, <laughs> one, two, three, here we go, now our fish is in the base, now we're going to cook the fish about seven to eight minutes before we add the vegetables. Okay, after a few minutes, we can add our vegetables. Let's add some of the bean spouts. Save some for later. Since some are going to serve as a hot pot. And soft tofu. Mmm, smells so good. and slices of potatoes so we'll let this cook until the vegetables almost done or done and then we're going to serve it okay our fish and vegetables almost ready let me just taste the Ross. Mm. It's good, but a little bit salty. I just need to add a little bit of water. And now we're ready to transfer to the hot pot. Today I'm going to use my electrical hot pot. Now let's transfer our fish. I'm not going to break it. Mm -hmm. Gently. Hold on. Okay. Beautiful. And that's a little bit big for this part, but it'll be okay. And let's take our broth. There's a hot pot fish or a fish hot pot. I'm so excited, I can't wait to eat. 
we're going to just garnish with, with our cilantro. Fish is ready. Smells so good here. I wish you guys were here, but I'm going to taste for you. It's a piece of fish. Mmm. The good balance of spiciness, numbness, and you can taste all the spices, star anise. Cinnamon, the fish, very tender. Let's get a piece of tofu, potato. So we have all the flavors. You don't need, even need a dipping sauce, but you can always make your dipping sauce with sesame oil. Mmm. Potato square. Tofu, very tender. Let's try the crunchy bean sprouts, soy bean sprouts. Awesome. It's a great dish to share with your friends and family and please try it out and if you like this video please give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe thank you so much for watching see you next time